And this particular question, as you can see, uh, there is a bracket and there is a power two. Yes. So I will be just yes. applying the identity first of all, a plus b whole square. So answer would be sine square a plus x square a plus two sine a sec a. Similarly, I will be applying the identity in the second bracket cos square a plus cos x square a plus 2 cos a cos a k. Understood? Uh, yes. Now, sine square a cos square a will give me 1. Yeah. Now, I don't think so. We have any identity for sec square a and cos x square a. We have sales tax. We don't have this identity. So I will be keeping it as it is. Sec square a. And uh, let's see what needs to be done. Sec square a plus 2 sine a. Uh, if I just convert this into sec. Let's see, I'm just writing it as it is. Sec can be converted to one upon cos. Cos. Yes or no? Cos. Yes. One upon cos. Yeah. So should I keep it or not? Let's see. Let me just keep it upon cos A plus yeah. cos X square A. So this should be A, not theta. Yeah. And uh, plus 2 cos A upon sine. As of now, this thing is there. Now, okay. since I, uh, you can see that, okay, this is going to be complicated a lot. So let me just solve the right hand side a little bit to understand what should we do. Understood? Okay. So I'm going to solve the RHS because it's a whole square thing. No? So this will give me an idea of what I should do. So this will be okay. a square plus sec square a Cos x square a that is b square a square plus b square plus 2a plus 2a two that a. means 2 2 sec k cos a cos sec k. K. okay so basically i should be able to get this thing 1 plus sec square a cos x square a plus 2 sec a cos a k so okay. I'm able to get only one right now. Only one I'm able to get. As of now, I'm not yeah. able to get anything yeah. else. Two sec a cos a k. Since I'm going to convert everything into sine and cos this side, so let me just convert this side also to sine and cos, so that I'm able to match it. So this is okay. one. Mm, sec yes, one will become one, one upon cos square. Cos square a into sine square a. So plus two upon cos square uh, cos a sine a. Okay. Uh, yes. And LCM I will be getting is sine square a cos square a. So sine square a cos square a plus one plus one. two sine a cos a. Okay. So this is nothing but a square plus b square plus 2ab. 
So I yes. should be able to get sine cos a plus one whole square upon sine square a cos square a. So let me see. I have just solved the right hand side a little bit. Okay. And let me see yeah. whether I'll be able to get it or not. So I'm going okay. to convert everything into sine and cos. So I'm going left to erase side. this part, left hand side, in this step only, and then I will see what I can do. So this will become one upon cos square, cos square, and uh, this will become one upon cos sine square, sine square. So again, LCM will be sine, sine, sine square, square into Possibly. So thankfully, I'm able to get the denominator correct. Yes or no? I'm able to match. Yes. It. Okay. Yes. Now this one will become sine square a cos square a. Okay. Plus. Yeah. In the second one, I have cos square a already. Cos sine square, square a will be there. Okay. Over here, I have denominator cos only. So this will be, yeah. uh, and cos sine also. Sine, sine, is and sine, and sine is also there. Two sine. Uh, one two second. sine and cos. Uh, one second, one second. So basically, sine square will get multiplied. So it will be two sine cube A. Multiply by cos a. Yeah, so 2 tan plus 2 cot. Okay, let's see where do we go, where do we reach. This will become cos square a. Okay, and uh, the last one will become 2 cos cube a. And sine yeah. a into sine a. So Cause once again, cost. this is this is going to be one. Already it was one. Yeah. Okay. This is going to be one. I'm going to get sine square a cos square a plus one. And uh, from these two, this two can be um, taken sine square a cos square a common. No, I can take Not two sine, a cos. sine cos common sine a cos a common. Okay, so in yeah. this bracket, this two gone cos gone and one sine gone, so it will be sine, sine square. square, and from here. Similarly, cos square will become okay. Right. Understood. And yeah. uh, in the denominator, it will sign same square thing. And, and this thing will be one. one. Yeah. So okay, answer I is sine square a cos square a. Plus one plus two sine cos a upon sine square a multiply by cos square. A. Now, if you see, that is one step before. It's exactly same. Can you see that? So LHS oh, yes. equals to RHS. So I don't need the last step. It is unnecessary for me right now because it's matching in the midway also. So I'm going to do that. Okay, so I will be writing as LHS equals to RHS. Therefore, hence proved. Very dangerous question. Can you see uh, the real meaning from day one? I'm telling you. 
Sometimes we have to solve both RHS and LHS, then they will be proved. Remember, I was studying from the day yeah. one. Yeah, so this is the very good question because if I'm able to do till this part, it is difficult for me to go uh, to this particular question on the right hand side. Now, if I have to do that, some teachers say, no, this method is incorrect. Then what you can do, you can take this thing and keep dividing each number. Okay. But uh, yeah, it is going to, uh, yeah. So what will happen? This will take you to this place. And from here, this will take you to this place. And then you can go to this place. Is this thing clear? Oh, uh, yes. But as a teacher, I accept this answer. So it depends upon your class teacher also. But in board exam, this is valid. Sure. Oh. Wait. 